it's time for this week's Letters of Laugh In. Let's see what the old mailbag has brought us tonight. Well, here's a goodie. A guy writes, my girlfriend is so ugly, when you blow a dog whistle, she hears it. And that's not all. Her, her measurements are 34, 24. She's very short. <laughs> Oh, how about this one? A girl writes that her boyfriend can hold his liquor, but he can't hold the glass, and he drops it and spills it and just hates to waste any. So, <laughs> in laughing it up, he's developed a 57-inch tongue. <laughs> I do find that hard to believe. <laughs> Uh, here's a goodie. <laughs> this one comes from Kevin McMillan of Stockton, California. And Kevin writes, Raquel Welch ain't got nothing on me, but I sure wish she did. <laughs> I'll drink to that, Kevin. Uh, this, uh, this isn't going to make you fall off your chairs or anything, but if you think about it a minute, you're going to really like it. Uh... <laughs> Sad. How's it going, Dan? <laughs> well, Alan, now get this, folks. Hey, uh, Alan, a lot of the students at colleges today don't know much about American history. <laughs> well, you can't blame them. Most of it happened before they were born. <laughs> oh, kids. You kids. Come on, listen. I got a goodie. <laughs> this is us listening. Okay. It's uh, <laughs> all I want. This fellow writes, my girlfriend takes the pill, but she's nearsighted and keeps getting cold pills instead. They've got 14 kids, but none of them were born with a cold. <laughs> here, here, here's a thoughty one. Now just think about it. <clears throat> yes, this is from W.P. Stewart of Ottawa, Canada. It's the announcement of a pilot to his passenger on the plane about to land. You got the picture? All right, now the pilot's stalking, and he says, we are now arriving at Burbank, descending to an altitude of 5,000 feet. The weather is clear and sunny. We'll be on the ground shortly, so please extinguish all cigarettes, fasten your seat belt, and set your watch back 20 years. Oh, <laughs> I got one, Judy. Okay, um, I'll ask you. <laughs> all right. Isn't this fun? <laughs> 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 Did you know that Richard Burton is considered to be one of our greatest thespians? You got your thumb on my line. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's so much for Letters for Laugh and for this week. I never knew our audience was so hilarious. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Frankly, it's got me just a smidgy do worry. Well, what do you mean, sir? Well, if this keeps up, they're liable to replace us with a letter opener and call the show right in. Bite your tongue. Mm.